Hi, good morning. I am Maria Collado Sánchez and I'm going to present my research plan. I am a PhD student at the University of Salamanca and I belong to the PhD program on education in the knowledge society with the mentoring and supervision of Francisco José García Peñalbo and Ana María Pinto Llorente. The title is Computational Thinking Competencies Training for Primary Education Teachers. Computational thinking is a term that is being integrated at great speed in many educational contexts, where true innovation is being sought. Janet Wynn is the main promoter, who in 2006 published the article entitled Computational Thinking. She defined it as a set of actions that involve solving problems and designing systems, using some of the fundamental concepts of computing and informatics. The European Commission Science Center promotes dig digital competence through DigiComp, Many countries use this manual as a reference of, for the digital education initiatives. DigiComp identifies five main competencies areas in which computational thinking could be included. Highlight competencies such as programming, problem solving, creativity, collaboration and teamwork, digital content creation and interaction and communication. First of all, this research arises from the necessity of serving in previous studies to integrate computational thinking in all educational stages. These authors emphasize it that digital competence and computational thinking are essential life skills in the 21st century that every study should know and learn. Numerous studies saw that many early childhood and primary school teachers do not receive specific training in programming, robotics or computational thinking. This produces multiple forms of intervention that have a direct impact on student learning. Therefore, it will be necessary a manual on how to implement and work on computational thinking in the classroom. The general objective in this research is to propose a curricular approach to computational thinking competencies through active methodologies in primary education classrooms. Then, as specific objectives, to carry out a systematic review of the literature on computational thinking, to elaborate a training course on computational thinking competencies oriented to primary education teachers, to evaluate the level of competencies acquired in the training in educational context, and last, to know and evaluate the effect of the training on the competencies acquired and implemented by the teachers in computational thinking. The methodology consists of a mixed method composed by four stages. The initial stage consists of a systematic literature review and mapping to define the state of the art and context. The second stage is quantitative, which consists on the development of a teacher training course implemented through a MOOC, Massive Open Online Course. The third stage is qualitative, which consists of the elaboration of a didactic proposal in which Scratch is used to develop the competencies learning in the MOOC. And the last, the last stage consists of a triangulation of the results to contrast the information collected in the second and third stages. The evaluation instrument is on the quantitative side questionnaires and on the qualitative side focus groups or individual interviews. Thus, data collection and analysis will be done with ESPSS and NVivo software respectively. The target population of the research are primary school teachers, preferably 5th and 6th grade. Finally, the expected results and conclusions are to train teachers in computational thinking competencies, to introduce computational thinking at early ages, such as early childhood and primary education, and the last, to establish common guidelines and a framework that allow the correct implementation of computational thinking or programming. Here are my contact details. This is all for now, and thank you very much for your attention.